All right, so for today, we're gonna to be installing the uh, Abunai Supply uh, Grip Wrap for the AAP-01. Um, at the time of making this video, these are not like currently released to the general public, um, but these are available um, in some places. Um, but the only tool you need is gonna be a flathead screwdriver. So we have that, and let's go ahead and get started. So basically, um, you have kind of the main sticker and then you have the sticker that goes on the back of the gun. We're going to start off with the main sticker. Um, you want to start on one corner and then you want to kind of just slowly peel all of the stuff off or the whole thing off. I like to kind of uh, skip the cutout so you have a cutout that's like right here um, and that's this on the pistol and then you also have a triangle cutout at the bottom that's for this triangle hole. Um, I skip those um, when I install them, so I just kind of take everything but leave all the cutouts. And then after I apply the main sticker, then I'll put the cutouts on if I want them. So we'll, we'll go ahead and start kind of peeling this. And then the flathead is going to be used to kind of just make sure that we uh, leave the cutouts on the sticker. Um, but yeah, this will just take me a second to kind of go around and get everything all um, sort of peeled up. And I recommend you do not put the triangles on, but the little side panels are going to be like an optional type of thing. Alright, there we go. So we got the main sticker off. And then we can set that up, this off to the side for now. But... I like to kind of line it up with one of these bottom uh, triangles on the gun. So I do that first. I get one of the triangles perfect. And then I'll um, get the other cutout perfect as well. And you can stretch these a little bit to get them lined up. But don't, don't like like press it down um until you have it like for sure good right so just kind of have it lightly on there until you um know that it's gonna be great um and then we want to wrap this around and then when you wrap this around you want to make sure that um it's in the center here so it looks like i did a good job um, this is kind of the halfway point where you can know if you did a good job or not if this is kind of centered with the trigger guard um, how it is now that's good right and you want to keep going onto the other side then again you want to line up the uh the triangle at the bottom it's kind of the first thing you want to line up and then everything else will kind of follow after that And then you like the cutouts are kind of the main part you want to make sure the cutouts are good um, because that's the part that's going to be kind of um, overlapping like visible you can kind of see if it's on there good or not um, I might need to kind of redo this side as long as you don't get the whole sticker pushed down you should be able to kind of um, adjust it a little bit but um, Definitely don't like press anything down super hard if you're not um, for sure about where it's gonna be. And it's it's probably never gonna be perfect. You're never gonna get it on there exactly how it should be, but um, it's all about being close enough for the most part on these stickers. Um, and then right over here, you need to press that down sort of. So I just did that there. Um, and then anything that's kind of sticking up like right here, um, where the uh, magazine release is, you need to use like your fingernail and press that down, try to get it to stick. And then you want to kind of go over the whole thing, just patting it all down, trying to get everything all on there good. And then you also want to make sure that you have the cut up here lined up. So I have mine a little bit off. There we go. That's good there now. Over here again. Just make sure you press everything down. Make sure everything's all kind of stuck to the gun pretty good. <clears throat> 
And then if you have some stuff that doesn't like look good, like it's sticking like out or it's like jagged or something, you can always just cut it uh, with like a sharp knife. Um, I've done that to most of the grips, but this one looks pretty good how it is. So I probably won't have to worry about doing that to this one. All right, and then now we go ahead and put these side panels on. These are very straightforward. Um, you just need to kind of get it lined up at the at the bottom here. And then just kind of uh, drop it down in. And use your flat head again. Just make sure everything gets all pressed down good. And the panels are kind of um, finicky a little bit, but um, it's not that hard to get them to line up good. You're just going to always have a little bit of a gap, sort of, if you look at it from the side, but it's not, not that big of a deal. Go the other side. The main thing is just making sure that everything's all kind of stuck down as good as it can be. Um, and again, it's, it's never going to be perfect, but you want it to be as good as possible. So that looks pretty good there. Now we'll do the back panel, and that's the last thing. And then, you, and then you'll be all, uh, all set. Let's go ahead. And the back panel is pretty straightforward. Um, there's a hole at the bottom here. Um, I don't know how well the camera's going to see this because it's black, but you just got to line up with the hole at the base, and then make sure it's kind of going straight. And you want to get like the middle pressed down, and once the middle is all pressed down, it's so, like middle going like up like this, um, then you can kind of press down the sides, and that'll kind of uh, sort of flip it so it's all adhering perfectly. And there we go. It's all on there. And then again, you want to kind of go over it again, make sure everything's all pressed down good. But that is uh, that is how you do that. I hope that was useful if you needed that. Um, have a uh, have a nice day. These are pretty nice. Um, I am happy that these are finally going to be a thing um, because I have on my, I don't have it next to me, but I have a Glock one um, on my other pistol. I'll actually go grab it real quick so I can show you the difference. All right, so I'm back. So um, I did this. So this was, this is just a normal Glock uh, grip wrap uh, from the same company, but I did this way before this. Um, and you can probably tell the difference already. Like it's, uh, this is definitely meant for this gun and it looks a lot better uh, than this does. Um, and like I had to trim back here to make this fit. And I got these finger grooves that kind of work, kind of don't work. Um, but this is, this is nice. I like having the full, um, the full picture on the front of it where it's not like cut up like this one is. And I just like the overall sort of fit and finish of these new um, grips from Abunai Supply. So that is, uh, that is it. Um, I hope that was useful if you needed that. So have a, uh, have a nice day again. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if this video was useful for you. And make sure you check out uh, the link down below. Uh, that is a link to our Discord server, and you are welcome to join. All right? Have a nice day.